Hello guys, it's Max Chirocrati here, doing a brand new WWE Predictions video! It's August the 18th, this is recorded. So this gets Friday. Uh, this is for NXT TakeOver Brooklyn number 3, which... I said, it might be better than some stuff. Because 9 to 10, Brooklyn usually is. <laughs> uh, okay, we've got 5 matches. Uh, again, it's a bit... Uh. Uh, so we've got Johnny Gargo versus... Adriana Alas with Selena Vega. Trying to be sick. Vega from fucking Street Fighter, really. Oh, uh, I'm just gonna go Johnny Gargo. This time. And next we have a list of black versus ha this one name I always pronounce wrong. Haya told me, I always pronounce it wrong. I just do. <laughs> it's hard to pronounce. Uh, I wonder if I list of black because I'd like to see him get a win. Uh, it'd be good to tell me winning, but uh, uh, next match is the Aphrodite's Appeal, Arkham and Razor with Paul Elliott versus Sanity, Alexandria Wolf, Kelly and Diana with Eric Young and Nick Cross for the NXT Tekken titles. Now, straight away, no shadow of a doubt, Sanity needs to win the titles. We need Sanity to get the titles for a bit now, let, let Aphrodite pins move to the roster. Because there's a lot you could do with them, a lot. Definitely. Um, Next we have Oscar versus Emma Moon. I just this is gonna be a really short video, sorry about it, but it's NXT. <laughs> You'll keep it short and sweet because it's awesome. Um Okay, it's uh for the NXT woman set lost screen Emma Moon. I've got to say Emma Moon. I want to see Emma Moon win it because the last past few people she's lost and she's been getting one of so I've got to think she might win it. Which I don't saying it should be because we need Oscar on the main roster. Put her on SmackDown, we need her on SmackDown, we need we need a woman to go and kick an ass. Another one. Sorry, enough doing it, but I still want to see more. <laughs> uh, um, and then the final match is Bobby Roode for Drew McIntyre for the NXT Championship. Now, Drew, Drew McIntyre, hands down, I love Drew McIntyre since he was last in WWE, since he was in Impact Wrestling, not in the MSG after we I loved him. I've always loved Drew McIntyre. But he's a brilliant, phenomenal athlete. He is the chosen one. Um, but WWE never used him last time properly, and then when he got the NXT title, they took it off him. It's like, uh. Give him the NXT Championship, then put him on the ring roster, then give him an actual main title, like the Duty Championship or the Universal Championship. Either way, it's at least it's won the main titles, you know what I mean? It's just ridiculous how they haven't given him a shot. He deserves a shot. He's Drew McIntyre. <laughs> He's from Air Scotland. Bloody. <laughs> um, but on that, yeah, this, this NXT Brooklyn seems a lot, a lot more banked than last year's. Um, Two didn't really get. I didn't really hear much. We go. Oh yeah, yeah, this year three. I'm definitely gonna love it, which I'm pleased about, because it is really good. Uh, I'm, I'm just checking the dates for the next one. The next one's November, January, April, and August. I, su I suppose in some aspects, I want to enjoy watching that one. Uh, in Texas one, because anything can go with that one. Uh, but I will be doing my duty. Um, SummerSlam one after this. Uh, so. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, leave a comment on improvements wise. You may notice this is voiceover because it's getting clustered enough. I'll, I'll just do it as quick as I can so it's out the way, you know what I mean? Uh, but okay, uh, thanks for watching and goodbye.